Dan Hardy was recently fired over a disagreement he had with a UFC employee during a recent visit to Fight Island. When BJPenn.com initially reported this story, the title included the fact that it was a female employee. According to Dan, this detail was totally irrelevant and therefore misleading. His firing and the altercation had nothing to do with gender. Dan says it was a disagreement over an opportunity missed or withheld, and when he reached out to the UFC, he wasn't able to get any answers. Since these events have unfolded, Dan Hardy has released several tweets implying that the way the story was portrayed and the timing of the story's release was a coordinated effort with the UFC to make him look unfavorable. Adam Martin, the journalist who wrote the article, has since fixed the title and apologized to Dan for the misunderstanding. In another tweet, Dan says, Thank you for the kind words and support. I'm doing just fine, and I'm not going anywhere. I'll still be breaking fights down on my channel and elsewhere. I'm here in service of MMA, and sometimes that puts you on the other side of the line. I'm fine with that. Many MMA fans seem to be in agreement that Hardy was fired because he spoke the truth too often. What do you guys think? Was that the case? Also, where do you think Dan Hardy will go now that he no longer works for the UFC? I personally think he's going to make his long-awaited return to the Octagon. Make sure to subscribe to the Low Kick MMA YouTube channel for all the latest news, event previews, and interviews with some of the biggest stars in MMA.